One of the things you really don't want to find is standing water in your kitchen sink. Uh, I've put in the liquid plumber and it is doing nothing. So there is a more advanced clog. And now i got to figure out how to fix it. <clears throat> Alright, so we've got the regular P-trap right here. Uh, I'm going to try and take that off and see if it's just clogged in here. My, uh, I don't think that's the case. I think it's going to be clogged back in there farther, but we'll see. Alright, this is a really tough angle. Um, I'm just going to take this off and not shoot it right now. I'm pretty sure you've probably seen someone take off a P-trap before. Well, I ended up taking out most of the drain plumbing in order to get to here, and I can feel it. There's a whole chunk of waxy grease that's built up inside this, and I can just feel it right there. So, yeah, gonna have to get a have to get a sneak in there, I think, and get all that grease out. That's just ugly. All right, let's have a look and see what's behind the curtain. I don't know if you can see the inside of that, but that's uh, pretty nasty. All right, let's see if we can get a snake up in there. come across something. Thank you, Piper. Yes, you're very healthy. I also found the big clog, uh, the one that's taking up the most issue, and that's in this tailpiece right there. So let me get that cleaned out, and I think we'll be done with the the gross part. All right, I have everything reattached. Uh, we're gonna fill up the sinks and see if they drain. All right, here goes nothing. Alright, that is indeed flowing. 
I think the main problem is fixed. I'm going to have to put some additional drain cleaner down there and let that do some of the work and clean out the pipes a little bit more. But for now, this is done. I still have to replace this faucet. The faucet is bad. 